I know um, from speaking to uh, a lot of our customers um, that you are in a very important stage right now of your digital transformation at Eon. Um, something um, much further ahead than most customers that I see. Um, but yet your data team has been kind of the front and center of this. So can you just give me a little bit more about that digital transformation and what it means for your company? I mean, a couple of years ago, we understood that uh, the future of energy needs to be decarbonized, decentralized, but also digital. And for us, uh, digital is one of the three cornerstones of our transformation. And there's no digital without data. It's true. And there's no data without the proper data management, data governance in place. Yeah. That's why uh, we put uh, data on the forefront of all the digital transformation. So that's uh, what's taking us to this particular moment here. Nice. <laughs> and then, like, what's um, your team and your team's yeah. priorities behind that? Mm -hmm. So how do they help drive that digital transformation across the arm? Uh First of all, digital transformation is very abstract, yeah. so you need to land it. You yes. need to, to kind of interpret it for your company. In our case, uh, digital was about to uh, unlock uh, value pools in a way that we couldn't do it before, right? Yeah. People think digital is about technology, it's uh, by no means about technology only. So you need to yeah. change the way you operate. And uh, part of this change is uh, the way you deal with uh, one of the, you know, the full of, of your digital life, which is data. Yeah. So that's, uh, that's where my team is playing a huge role here. Absolutely. So I, I've seen that your, your team is first class team mm -hmm. uh, and their ability to execute by themselves in their own individual roles mm -hmm. is hard enough. But how do you have the executive level team on board, <laughs> right? So you have, I, I've seen it and I've been very impressed with it from board level on down, mm -hmm. everybody dedicated to getting this right, getting this data uh, transformation completed. How do, how do you do that? How do you keep that from an organization standpoint? I mean, uh, you need to have the right mindset, and there's the right mindset needs to kind of start by the top. So yeah. our, our board, as we have a particular board member supporting us uh, a lot and very much uh, engaged particularly with uh, AI topics, which uh, really is uh, giving us, uh, you know, uh, wings uh, yeah. to, to fly. And uh, But it's not enough having the, you know, the, the top-down view. You really need to uh, go bottom up. And you need to convince each and every employee of Eon that the future is about, uh, you know, uh, applying new technologies, uh, which requires applying new, uh, kind of dealing with the data in a different way. And uh, for that, we are running uh, the so-called evangelization program, which uh, which consists of uh, first of all showing what you can do with data. Yeah. Uh, second is like bringing data closer to people. How do you do that? Um, uh, machine learning is difficult because at the end it's an algorithm and uh, you cannot just touch the algorithm. Yeah. But uh, we have uh, kind of uh, ideas like bring your own data where you take uh, kind of a data sets. We use uh, tools like Tableau Power BI. Yeah. But uh, for the first time, people can interact with the data they've been gathering for years. And believe me, it's a game changer. Oh, yeah. Not only that, it's like uh, when you just expect that people engage with data. It's really important to uh, give them the opportunity to learn and to skill them up a bit. And uh, the more they learn, the more they engage, the easier it is for you to kind of uh, um, implement this transformation.